Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you're looking for a job, you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to install Derby plugin in Eclipse. There are seven easy steps you can do. Do that. First step is download this Derby Core plugin and Derby UI plugin. Using these two URLs, you can download these two zip files. If you want to, if you want the latest version, you can change the version number and you can download. So these are the two URLs you can download these two zip files. Once you download these two zip files, you can you can extract it and copy to Eclipse plugins. So check whether check where you have installed Eclipse and traverse to plugins path. So like this. So once you have extracted, these are the three directories you should copy to. Eclipse plugins in your computer. So once that is done, click window, show view, other. You can see data management. Okay. So click that. Click the data source explorer, and you can see database connections folder. Okay. Right click on database connections. You will get a wizard connection profile wizard and select the derby because we are going to configure derby in this in this wizard you have to click the new driver definition this menu then ensure that you have selected derby embedded jdbc driver 10.2 once you selected you have to give the derby.jar in location information so you just copy three directories right out of that one directory core directory has the derby.jar so give the location here and click OK. Now you are ready with your you have already given the dri driver information to Eclipse. Now you are ready with the database creation. You can give your database name here, username and password. Click the test connection here. So you can check whether your DB is connected or not. You can also save the password. I've already created one database. Okay, and I have created one table. I'm going to just execute one query so that you can see the results so already database connection is ready in my Eclipse setup so I'm executing the query now so I got the results okay so this is how you can install Derby plugin in Eclipse hopes hope this video is useful thank you and all the best